consider the following formula. A equals B minus 2 times C plus 5. If A equals 6 and B equals 0, what is the value of C? Now, in order to solve this problem, we need to substitute the value of 6 in for A and the value of 0 in for B so that we can solve for C. Let's start by substituting in our values. A is 6, so 6 equals, instead of B, we put 0 minus 2, and we don't know C yet, so C stays the same. Now we can start to simplify. We can start with this set of parentheses right here. 0 minus 2 would give us negative 2. We can't do anything with these parentheses because C is an unknown variable, so we would leave those exactly as they are and bring down our equal sign on our, on our 6. Now we need to use distributive property to multiply negative 2 into C and into positive 5. So negative 2 times C would give us negative 2C. Negative 2 times positive 5 would give us a negative 10 and then bring down our equal sign and our 6. So now that C is outside of the parentheses, we can start to isolate it, which means we need to do opposite operations to all of the numbers on this side of the equal sign with C to get them over to the other side of the equal sign. Let's start by adding 10 to both sides. These two 10s will cancel out. 6 plus 10 will give us 16 equals, bring down the rest of our numbers, negative 2C. Negative 2 is being multiplied to C, so the opposite operation here is division. Divide both sides by negative 2. These will cancel each other out, leaving us with 16 divided by negative 2. Negative 8 equals C. So our answer is negative 8.